welcome. Andy Roman here. This is Get Real with Andy, chapter 16, I believe it is. And I'm calling this chapter Get Real with Work. You know, many people come to me um, as a therapist, and they're at a point in their life where what they're doing isn't really in alignment with who they are. They, they want some counsel on how to find a suitable way to make a living that, that works for them way better than what they're doing. Most people somehow fall into their work. You know, nobody really sets out to be certain things that people end up doing. And it's a very simple process. Like somebody, uh, you know, I stumbled on this myself. I asked a person, they were saying, oh, I've been in finance, I just don't like it. I said, well, what's your favorite thing to do? When you're on vacation, what do you do? What do you seek out? And the guy didn't hesitate. He said, I love whitewater rafting. And so I just asked the next, the next logical question is, well, how could you get paid for whitewater rafting? And he, he laughed and yeah, I guess uh, I could get people to pay me by, uh, I don't know, but you know, within a few months, he contacted me and he said, you know what? I bought a whitewater rafting business up near where I live. He was in upstate New York somewhere. And so far, it's really been fun. I get to share my passion and excitement by taking people out into these whitewater rafting excursions. And they, they love it. And I love their excitement. And they really love my excitement. So that was a good uh, success story. Then the another person who came to see me, she was at a pivotal point in her life, wanted some new direction. And I said, well, what are you, what are you good at? Or what do you do in your life? She said, yeah, I have a whole history of substance abuse and addiction. And I've been to rehab so many times. And I said, well, um, okay. Is that something you're good at? She said, yeah, I'm really good at being addicted and going to rehab. And then she said, you know, I've really come into Hippocrates where I'm changing my lifestyle. I'm actually starting to get addicted to really making healthy choices and living a healthy, healthy lifestyle. And I said, well, give some, you know, sleep on it a while. See if you can come up with something. And sure enough, she came up, she created a model of of a rehab she made a, a rehab for women and at the core of the program was a natural living foods lifestyle a vegan lifestyle and her program she got funding for it and it was very very successful she ended up being booked months and months in advance and you know she said yeah i'm getting paid for what i'm good at and that's like being in rehab and so I've created a really good program. And you know what? I'm getting paid to stay sober and to, and to stay on the program. So it really works. But my favorite story is this. A couple came to see me. He was a doctor. She was a nurse. And they were tired of their medical work. You know, very marketable skills that they both had. And I said, well, what do you love to do? What do you do on vacation? And they said, well, we go hiking in the woods. That's our favorite thing to do. We love being out in nature. And I said, well, what about it is your favorite thing? And they, they sort of looked at each other and they giggled. And I said, come on, what, what are you giggling about? And they were looking at each other, you know, you tell him. No, no, you tell him. And finally, he said to me, we love having sex outdoors in nature. And so in my great wisdom, I said, well, how could you get paid for doing that? And they laughed and laughed. And even I laughed because it sounded so absurd to me. But I tell you, within a year or so, they contacted me and they had created a business where they took couples out into nature, backpacking, teaching relationship skills and fostering relationship bonding. And so they took a bunch of these couples out into the wilderness and they themselves got to have sex out in the woods and they were being paid for it. So anyway, the moral of this story is that it is really possible to get real with work. It just takes some investigation and some 
openness to as absurd as it might sound, you know, how can you get paid for doing what you love to do? Make the inquiry, make the intent, be with it, sit with it, and then be creative. All right, thank you. Get real with work. It's doable. Read my books. Love you. Peace out. Thank you.